on the premises is White Out, straight into the lead, racing towards the first of ten flights, is followed by Keppel's Queen on the outside of Past the Time. Aurore Destruval is then being followed by Lemony with the juvenile slow motion having won behind in these very early stages. They've just jumped the opening flight. The back marker is Rock on the Moor. Off the bend and swinging in the first time towards flight number two, the leader is White Out and Paul Townend, followed by Keppel's Queen Mark Bolger just second from past the time and Noel Feely in third. Then comes Aurore Destruval with Lemony on the inside, representing last year's winning connection. Slow motion, three four lengths to rock on the moor. Flight number two, bring them up to pass the enclosures. The leader is white out in the stripes with a closer second now, Keppel's Queen, who draws alongside. Then pass the time and Aurore Destruval with slow motion, just going a place ahead of Lemony. Rock on the moor is last of the seven runners. On the run towards flight number three in the Irish Stallion Farms European Breeders Fund Mare's Champion Hurdle, and the leader is White Out, followed by Keppel's Queen on the outside of Past the Time, then Aurore Destruval with a slow motion next, Lemony and Rock on the Moor, making the climb up now towards flight number four as they turn away from the stands. White Out leads by just over a length, with in second place Keppel's Queen, a further break of two lengths to pass the time, who's being followed in fourth place, reaching this next flight by Aurore Destruval, and the leading quartet have shifted on a bit now from slow motion, Lemony, and Rock on the Moor. Making the descent downhill towards the next flight, which is flight number five, at close enough halfway, Whiteout continues to lead Keppel's Queen, past the time Aurore Destruval, then four lengths to slow motion, who's tracked by Lemony and Rock on the Moor, continues to bring up the rear. At the flight, the bottom of the track, Whiteout leads Keppel's Queen, then past the time, who was joined in jumping there by Aurore Destruval, five lengths to slow motion, then Lemony and Rock on the Moor. As the seven runners turn right-handed to race down the back straight towards the first of two, they have another five left to jump. White out by a length and a half to Keppel's Queen, about the same to pass the time. Just showing third from Aurore Destruval, and then comes slow motion and Rock on the Moor relegates Limony to be the back marker now. A mile left to go, racing towards the fifth flight from the finish. It's flight number six in the lead as White out followed by Keppel's Queen. No changes there in those first two, followed a couple of lengths back by Aurore Destruval and past the time who raced together. Slow motion, Rock on the Moor, and Lemony is last of the seven. Now they're racing towards the final flight in the back straight, four from home. Keppel's Queen on the outside, just rose in the lead from White Out, followed by Aurore Destruval, and then past the time, slow motion, Rock on the Moor, and Lemony as they come out of the back straight. Less than five furlongs to go. They have another four flights, uh, three flights to jump, and it's White Out who's joined, one from the rail by Keppel's Queen, then Aurore Destruval on the inside past the time, slow motion, Barry Gary just got a bit lower there in the saddle, Rock on the Moor and Lemony, coming out of the third last flight, Keppel's Queen with a long side, White Out as they make the run towards the second last, then Aurore Destruval, past the time, Rock on the Moor, driven along now with slow motion, and they're followed into the straight by Lemony, over the second last, Rock on the Moor, a sideways jump there, as her stay the companion Keppel's Queen just picks it up on the home turn from wide out, being followed by Rock and the Moor. Lemony is racing round them on the outside, beginning to close off the last bend. They've one flight to jump in the Irish Stallion Farms European Breeders Fund Mare's Champion Hurdle. White out is battling back on the inside of Keppel's Queen, covering all moves as Lemony on the near side, and then Rock and the Moor clear from slow motion. And White out has she got the first run in her stable companion here. White out is safely over the last in the ball town and, and it's a five leg cushion now from Lemony and in third place Keppel's Queen and it's White Out and Paul Town and driven home to win the Mayor's champion beats Lemony her stable companion tight third and fourth between fellow stable companions Rock on the Moor and Keppel's Queen then slow motion